For this video tutorial, we will cover how to install the photo driver on Windows 10. Proper installation of the driver allows your Windows PC to detect a connected printer. Failure to properly install the driver could prevent your printer to print from the PC. Installing the driver onto Windows 10 requires only a few simple step-by-step -step changes to your Windows settings. Before you download your driver, make sure that you have disconnected the printer USB from the PC. Verify what Windows system you're using to install the correct driver. On your keyboard, press the Windows and Break key at the same time to view the PC's basic information. Verify that you are using Windows 10 and confirm whether you are using 32-bit or 64-bit operating system. For this demonstration, we'll be installing our drivers to a 64-bit Windows 10 operating system. If you are installing drivers on a different system or using a different printer, you can refer to our other driver install videos for specific tutorials. Open your internet browser. In the search bar, type me-vis.com and press enter. Navigate to the products tab and select professional printers. Click on Photo Printing and Finishing Solutions. Since we are using the D707 for this demonstration, select the CPD 707 dw Click on the Resources tab. From here, you'll see a list of drivers compatible with specific systems. Right-click on the Windows 864 bit. Select Save As and save the folder onto your desktop. We will first need to disable the computer's driver signature verification. This is a Windows security measure. The following steps we provide will allow you to successfully install the driver. We will first need to disable the computer's driver signature verification. This is a Windows security measure. The following steps we provide will allow you to successfully install the driver. Begin by clicking on the Start menu. Select Settings from the list. Click on Update and Security. Click Recovery. Click Restart Now under Advanced Startup. In a few moments, you will enter the recovery mode. Navigate into Troubleshoot, Advanced Options, and click on Startup Settings. Then select Restart. Finally, you will be given a list of startup settings that you can change. The one we're looking for is Disable Driver Signature Enforcement. Press the F7 key to choose the setting. The PC will then reboot and you will now be able to install the driver without any issue. Navigate into the desktop and locate the enclosed driver folder. Right click on the folder to access the drop down menu. Click Extract All. Direct the contents to your desktop and click Extract. Start by opening Devices and Printers. Hold the Windows key and press R on the keyboard to open up the Run command. Type Control Panel into the search and press Enter. Click on Devices and Printers. In the Devices and Printers window, select any icon listed under Printers and Faxes and click Print Server Properties. Open the Drivers tab of the Print Server Properties and click Add. Click Next on Welcome to the Add Printer Wizard. If you're using a 32-bit system, check X86. For 64-bit systems, check the X64 box. 
Since we are using a 64-bit system, we will click on X64 for this demonstration. Click Next. Click Have Disk to browse and select the folder where the printer driver is stored. The folder should be located on the desktop. Open the designated printer file. Click OK. Click Next. Click Finish. Power on the printer and connect it to your computer via USB to automatically install the USB port. Open an image and perform a test print to verify your installation. Make sure that you have selected the right printer. Set the correct print size and click print. In the event that there is an error, there are a few key points to check, one of which could be a problem in the USB and another could be in printing an incorrect print size. 